And off the top at six, a Michigan judge has approved a request to temporarily pause enforcement of the state's 1931 ban on abortion. This comes after a draft opinion leaked from the U.S. Supreme Court saying a majority of judges would support overturning Roe v. Wade. News Ace Kyle Mitchell is here in the studio with what state legal experts are saying. Kyle. Sue and Brian, in the ruling today from Court of Claims Judge Elizabeth Leitcher, she says a Planned Parenthood lawsuit had a strong likelihood of winning the case against the 1931 law, and the injunction is needed to protect rights granted under Michigan law. In a ruling, she said, quote, after 50 years of legal abortion in Michigan, there can be no doubt but that the right of personal anatomy and bodily integrity enjoyed by our citizens, including the right of a woman in consultation with her physician to terminate a pregnancy. A law professor from Detroit uh, Mercy Law School says the question of the right to bodily integrity will be key. I'm going to quote uh, Justice Cooley uh, from Michigan Supreme Court back in the late 1800s. Um, the right to be let alone, that the, the right to a person's body is a right to um, complete immunity rel relative to um, decisions made about your body. And his opinion as the Michigan Supreme Court Justice has been cited by the Supreme Court for uh, many years. The Court of Claims judge who made this ruling did previously notify all parties involved that she donates to Planned Parenthood annually and volunteered to work as an attorney for Planned Parenthood while working for the ACLU in 1996 and 1997. The judge says she does not believe this warrants her recusal from hearing the case. Sue.